Hey guys, it's Justin and Alicia, and today we thought we would let you get to know us a little better. And we thought it would be a lot more fun if we played a game to do that rather than just sitting here and talking to you. So we thought we'd do the couples tag or marriage tag or oh, yeah. whatever. Basically, I took a bunch of different questions from different tags and quizzes and stuff and put them together so that we could answer them. I'll ask a question, we'll write down our answers, and then we'll say them at the same time and see if we said the same thing. Are we writing landscape or portrait? I guess whichever you prefer. <laughs> All right. But no, it's gotta be landscape, I'm sorry. It gotta be the same. Okay. okay, question number one is, how long have we been together? Forever. From the Sandlot in the Squiz Boys. <laughs> Thanks for that. It's been a long time. It has been 16 years since we started dating and 11 since we got married and that's in two weeks. It'll be 11 years. I feel like that was a cop out. It wasn't a cop out. It was a total cop out. Next question is, when we go out to eat, who chooses where we eat? Because you're very opinionated and stubborn and strong-willed and all of that stuff. Yes, you are. That would be my daughter. Who is just like you. Okay. If you were able to eat the same thing every day, what would it be? What did you say? Oh, I said chicken enchilada. <laughs> Shout out to my mama. <laughs> the best chicken enchilada casserole ever. I love you, mama. Happy Mother's Day a couple weeks ago. Just to clarify, I did actually tell her that on Mother's Day. Now is not the time. <laughs> the only time. <laughs> Who goes to bed earliest? Justin in the recliner when we're watching TV. He doesn't even make it through one show. Once I know the day is over, I cannot help myself. The next question kind of goes along with it. Who wakes up the earliest? Who's a morning person? I misspelled definitely, so <laughs> we'll just say me. <laughs> I was gonna write definitely, and then I thought about just deaf, trying to sound cool. Deaf me. <laughs> deaf. Deaf not, not me. Deaf. Definitely me. If you were to ever go to jail, what would it be for? Killing them. <laughs> be for <laughs> killing them. <laughs> so whoever Madeline's boyfriend is going to be, I'm sorry. You better watch out. That's not a threat. <laughs> it's a promise. <laughs> I'm sorry. I said for somebody messing with his kids or his family. Yeah, that'll make any man go psycho. Who does the grocery shopping? Both, but more her. Who mows the yard? Justin. He takes care of all the outdoor gardening, groom, yard grooming, yard. maintenance, outdoor maintenance. Mowing the lawn, babe. Who does the laundry? Her mom. My mom. Thank you, mom. Shout out to her mom. My mom is a lifesaver. She comes mm. over and helps me. Otherwise, we'd be I dirty would be clothes. extremely embarrassed at work if you weren't here <laughs> doing laundry. <laughs> Wearing the same thing every day. And eighth grade kids would definitely make fun of me. Thank you. Thank you, mom. My mom keeps me from drowning, and she's amazing. She is. We're playing the game. Well, it's not. <laughs> How do you hear that over your headphones? Can I make it be you? Is your show still on? You're missing it. What's Sasha oh, don't doing? Miss it. What's Sasha doing? <laughs> Who picks the vacation spot? Me. You. What is your eye color? Brown. Brown. Are we asking yours now? Next question is what is my <laughs> eye color? Blue slash blue green. Do you remember which one is which? I think your right eye is blue. Yep. And my right eye is more blue and my left eye has a little bit more green. Who is the better dancer? 100% you. I put it depends on how serious we are. Because <laughs> <laughs> if we're silly dancing, I'm pretty dang good. <laughs> Where did we meet? Church. I was a sophomore. I was a fifth grader. <laughs> I'm just kidding. What were you? Uh, eighth eighth grade? grade? Yeah. He's two grades below me, but he's only 11 months younger than me. I was the youngest person in my grade, and, and he had, what was it called? Transition. He had Oklahoma. something called transition. Yeah, what's which, up, Oklahoma? 
tra do y'all still do transition? Everybody got put in a class. It was called transition. It was between kindergarten and first grade. Me, my Which? sister, my brother, all my friends. I swear, transition was real. <laughs> I ran away from kindergarten. Second day of school, ran away. Got off of the school grounds before someone stopped me and brought me back. I saw the front doors were walking in a line down to the gym. And I just remember thinking, I've tried this one day already. I don't like it. I don't want to be here. We were walking down to the gym. The teacher was at the front of the line. I looked and saw the front doors of the school. And I took off, pushed those doors open, ran down the street, around the corner. And I knew how to get home. I was on my way home. And, uh, and then a parent was walking home, I guess, and stopped me. And she was like, I think my daughter's in your class. Let me take you back to school. I was probably like, no, I don't think so. I think you got me mixed up with someone else. As a first grade teacher, I taught first grade for six years before the kids were born. That taught me that you always walk at the end of the line. Next question is, who has more shoes? I don't remember anything. <laughs> we'll leave it at that. Hey, a friend of mine, he said, what is Isaiah now? Like 17 months? Let's see, he was born in October. I was like, no, I don't think that's right. August? No, September? I had to tell him I struggle remembering his birthday because I remember so much else. When I think of Isaiah and his birth, I think if he's allergic to latex, that he has spina bifida, hydrocephalus, club feet. I remember all this other stuff and I, and I just didn't focus on his birthday. Well, and honestly, I can't tell you what he weighed when he was born. Because nope. that wasn't one of the things that yeah, we, we were focused, focused on, on other stuff. I wanted to make yeah. sure he was okay. I, I didn't care how much he weighed. I cared that he was all right. Who is most likely to get pulled over? Justin. Me. It doesn't happen a lot. <laughs> a lot more than me. He doesn't get tickets. No, I talk my way out. Say, hey, I'm sorry, I did turn when I wasn't supposed to. <laughs> I'm sorry, but your badge is really shiny and I like it. <laughs> is that how you do it? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Who drives on road trips? Justin. Me. Despite getting pulled over more than me. If you were to run into the store to get some milk and you grab me a treat, what would that be? Twix and Coke. Ah! Goals. Same question, but for me. Peanut M&M's and, and, and Dr. Pepper. Pepper. Ah, yeah. That's what I'm talking about. We're not even playing against anybody, but I feel like we're winning. <laughs> well, we hope that this has helped y'all get to know us a little bit better, and we want to get to know you too, so please leave us a comment and talk to us. Hmm, question for y'all. What state are you from? That's the question question that's an easy one to answer you don't have to think about it so what state are you from that's your question put it in the comments below i know we didn't talk about them a lot in this video but we have four but you can hear them <laughs> <laughs> we've got four-year-old triplets and a 20 month old all in all three boys one girl just have a lot of fun with them check out some of our other videos to get to know them a little better and if you enjoyed this please give it a like and subscribe and we'll see y'all next time yep See ya.